Hey everyone, it's the infamous Dr. Q, and this is Assassin's Creed 3, 100% synchronization, sequence 7, memory 1, the midnight ride. And I'm starting to celebrate Halloween right now, so... Hey, there's a horse glitch! Um, it's possible that uh, sequence 8 might not be going up tonight because I have had very little sleep since this game came out. But! Midnight ride! I'm gonna go ahead and leave the ride intact. So this is, uh, I mean, there's only really one part where you can blow the, uh, they must be the full sequence or the full synchronization in this. Be careful, but we must figured I might as well the leave the whole walkthrough in, so it takes some of the guesswork out of it. So you have to avoid oh, open conflict. Here up into a certain point where open on. conflict is mandatory and this house that I'm looking at right here is the one that you need to go to and of course that jump that I didn't mean to do got someone's attention and I have to run back a bit and run around to get these guys because normally they're supposed to just start walking forward when you get up there but because that one guy like saw a faint bit of motion behind a house. The, the whole unit just sort of sits there and does nothing. So now they're walking ahead. This is it. You just you gotta get up to the, the door, right interact with it, and then there's a brief cutscene. So you don't want to stay too close to the roads because they tend to have the Britishers on them. Go left up here. But having said that, going off-road with the horse is uh, glitch city sometimes. Yes, this is exactly where we need to be. Be on the lookout for Redcoats. So you gotta cross this, uh, this little river here. It's shallow enough to do so right there. And Paul Revere says we should get off the horse, and I say, Go fuck you, I'm riding the horse right up to the horse. goddamn door. I'm this is it! Going you to. have got the right place! So you're just going to keep riding down the road, but you want to veer off a bit to the right when you get to this bridge, because you can see there's a unit of, uh, of red coats to walking right, across it. To the right. I'll go right when I'm goddamn well ready, Revere. Fucking chump. So once they're across and there's enough room... Cross the bridge, and you're pretty much right where you need to be. Might be safer if we approach the houses on foot. Once again, fuck you, Paul. I'm gonna ride right up to the door. Now, after you interact with this door, this you have got the um, right place. there's a there's a red coat inside. You're immediately going to want to cut left, but you need to make sure you go around the first uh, fence. If you try to jump both fences your horse will get shot while you're crossing this field here so you'll see you'll see how i do it Master, we need to get away 
cut around left around that fence and then you jump this one into the field and then just keep going you'll lose them really quickly and this is very important because you're on a uh, time limit to get to the next destination and even not engaging anyone at all I think I had about 15 seconds left on the timer when I finally got there This is exactly where we need to be. Thank you, Paul. Keep going. Safer if we approach the houses on foot. Totally meant to do that. This is it. You have got the right place. So you get to this house, and the cutscene starts, and after this, there's no conceivable way that you can fail 100% synchronization on this uh, memory. So, there's the Midnight Ride.